Hey everybody, welcome back to the channel. It's Old Dino Squad Gamer here for another one. And today we're gonna to be looking at Dome. That's right, we're gonna be looking at this Dome ability. It's a really, really essential, essential ability if you're gonna be a sniper in the game. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put it on an Archon, which is of course the basic sniper straight out of the box. And we're gonna see what kind of damage we can actually do out there on the battlefield. So let's go. Let's get started right away. I'm gonna, first thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go up here and like, like you always do when you're a sniper is try to find the high ground. See, I'll get up here on this ledge and I'm going to start immediately scanning the battlefield. Now you can see I'm using my first ability which is my basically my sniping ability to zoom in. That gives you extra firing rate and extra damage and I'm always going to aim for that head. There you go, got that guy right there. Um, really, really doing, I mean, I got to take a step back too. Um, the Archon is really insane these days in terms of damage. Um, I, I don't know if it's going to get nerfed. I got to warn you, it might get nerfed because um, I know that it's, a, it's a, sort of a bone of contention uh, with some of the players on the Discord channel because they're frustrated that um, the other snipers, the more expensive snipers, actually aren't as good as the Archon these days. But anyway, whatever. As my old pappy used to say, you make hay while the rain uh, shines. Uh, so, <laughs> or something like that anyway. So uh, let's get in here and you can see right now I just activated my dome. Now the dome has a 30 second uh, duration and basically um, protects me in like a circle of about 30 meter uh, circumference around me. And I'm telling you right now, combining that with your actual zoom ability to uh, sort of scope in and shoot guys uh, just is, uh, like I can't even imagine trying to run a sniper without, without dome. Now, when I first started off, I didn't get dome, I should say, and uh, I was constantly being killed as a sniper. You know, you're 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 at the um, you're, you're at the mercy of other snipers. Um, other people could just kind of run right in and kill you. And I, uh, there you go. You can see that that cool sort of um, sort of honeycomb, blue honeycomb effect around me. That's my dome and in action. And you can see the cooldown timer on the right hand side. It's almost ready to shut down. So there you go. It's now over, but I can now relaunch it again. And so things you need to know about dome. Well, number one, uh, you can wear down. Uh, an opponent's dome and they can wear down your dome by shooting it so you can wear it down it basically has hit points um, so you've got to be careful you can't it's not like sort of a get out of jail free card where you can just do whatever you want uh, number two people can run inside the dome you can see this guy here see he's trying to run into my dome so I got to get the hell out of dodge I jump down off that ledge um, it's another trick you got to do when you're a uh, sniper. You got to be super, super um, ready to juke and jive if someone comes after you. And see, this guy Droopy here is a little mad at me because I was uh, shooting him several times, and now he's going to chase me all over the place. So I need to find a new place to set up. Um, I lost a little bit of health there, but look at this. He's stuck on that ledge. I'm going to really just like, keep hitting that circle. That's where the catastrophic damage is happening. Got him. Okay, so that's my monster times three. Um, okay, now I created my dome. You can see there, but you can run outside of your dome. So if you do need to escape, um, sometimes it's better to stay in the dome, but sometimes you just got to get out of there. You know, like you can't, you can't just um, stay in the dome and let someone just stomp on top of you. But look at it right now. Okay, check it out. I'm in my dome. I was, uh, this guy's coming right at me. He's trying to kill me. He wants to kill me. He can't pierce that dome with his weapons and I'm hitting him and hitting him and look at that with the help of, help of the teammate I was able to take him down. Let's see here I'm still in my dome I still have about probably 10 seconds left. Um, it's gonna recharge. I'm a little bit outside of it here but I'm gonna keep aiming at guys here. All right great I know my, my dome is recharged now I gotta find a new sniping position. Let's come on over here a little bit. See got this guy got him. Okay where else can I go? Let's go up over here to the left. Um, another thing you want to do when you are a sniper is you want to constantly be changing location, um, but not just scrambling all over the place, you know, like, like a chicken with its head cut off. You want to basically find clear sniping lanes of fire. See, now I can, just go, I can hone in on this guy. There's an Edison on the other side. Um, I'm in my dome. So I know I'm protected from this guy. Look, there's a sniper there and he sees me, but I get him first. There you go. Um, let's see if we can scope in again. I'm going to see if I can tackle some more of these Edisons. Got the guy there. Got myself a double kill. Oh, and there's an enemy sniper. Going to zoom in. Going to zoom in knowing that I'm protected by my dome. Oh, I should, I should mention too, taking a step back. So another thing you can do is um, your teammates can actually come into your dome and be protected. 
and you can go into your teammate's dome. So it's real, look at this, the guy was just trying to shoot me there and he couldn't get through because of my dome. I'm telling you, this is, this is the ability. If you're going to run a sniper, this is the ability you want to run. See here, I get this guy, look at this. Look at the catastrophic damage. No wonder people are mad at the Archon these days, eh? I'm just, man, I'm just hammering these guys from all the way on the other side of the map. These guys are in their giant, uh, looks like they're in giant monarchs over there. Uh, you know, they should be able to dominate the battlefield. And look at this, I'm all the way down. Um, you know, it's funny because some people say with snipers that, oh, well, you're just camping in the back. But look at me, I've come all the way up to the front and I've set up shop right outside of the uh, enemy home spawn. You know, that's aggressive sniping. That's basically, um, one of the things I like to do is I like to basically follow that bite and hold strategy, right? So you, you, you kind of take some territory, move ahead. Take some territory, move ahead. And look at this guy here. So I'm gonna sit here, got him, uh, oh, I'm taking down his health, I got my, my dome going, my dome protects me. Boom, there goes another giant dino, bites the dust. Who else is here? On the other side of the map. Oh, 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 oh. Ah, ah, ah. okay, okay, okay. My, my dome is gone. My dome is gone. I only got a few more seconds, but let's look at this. Look at this. I'm going to get him. I'm going to get him. Mr. Sober needs a drink. Boom. And I got my uh, dome now is now ready to activate. So I'm going to save it for a few seconds until... Because if you look at the... Um, if, you, if you look at the score up there, I'm playing elimination mode. And right now... We're up five to three in terms of the uh, the number of people on t on my team versus their team, so we totally got this game well in hand. Um, just basically, you're gonna uh, through attrition, we're gonna beat these guys. Look, this guy's charging me here, and I get myself a monster. Craziness. All right, where else could we go? Let's get this guy here. Um, now, but the, here's the thing. Look at that. My dome is gone. Why? Because the sniper guy that I just killed actually shot my dome and wore it down. So again, it's a great reminder. It's coming from Monster Times 2. Um, it's, it's a great reminder that you are not invulnerable when you use the dome, right? So I'm going to put the dome up here, protect myself. This guy's coming at me. He's charging me. Yeah, he shouldn't be charging me. I and mean, you shouldn't charge people with a sniper. He should, he should have found some cover and he should have basically set up camp and basically tried to take me down through attrition. But boy, oh boy, this is just like a shooting gallery here. Look at this. And there's only two guys left. We're only a couple minutes left of the game. I still have my dome. I can shoot this guy from across the map. Now, um, I'm taking a, one more little step back because this game is going to end pretty soon, but uh, just one, a couple more, um, one or two more points about dome. So you can get dome for all of your dinos, but they, it costs differently um, depending on what dino it is. So some, in some cases it's more expensive, some cases it's less expensive. I also would argue that um, while, you know, I, in all cases dome will help you, say, if you want to run and set up camp at a tower and hold the tower or, or that kind of thing. But on the other hand, there are some dinos that actually, um, they rely on being fast. And if you are in a super fast little tiny dino that counts, um, you know, it's survival on being able to run, hide, take off, attack, ambush, dome probably isn't for you because uh, dome stands still. And so while you're running off in a direction, the dome stays behind you. And so to me, you're not kind of getting your money's worth if you're creating a dome and then just running outside the dome and taking off somewhere. It seems to me that um, there's other, uh, other abilities and other modules probably that would be more effective for some dinos. But for snipers, 100%, get yourself a dome. You will not regret it. Um, I, I, for me, I mean, it was just crazy. I think I got 20 kills in that game. It's insane. So until next time, See you on the battlefield, and please hit that like, that share, that subscribe, and, you know, drop me a line in the comment, tell me what you think, um, you know, uh, post some, post some uh, domes and link it to me. Can't wait to hear from you. So until next time, see you on the battlefield.